So yeah. Louie. Yeah. Can I grab two? Yeah. Take it easy. I mean, two is good enough. Two? So what do we got here, Louie? Uno. What is this? Gracias, just dos para mí. Well, I know that John Carlos and Angel are gonna take like six, so I don't need to. I can take two. Two. Two is good. I mean, it hurts my head. Yeah, imagine six. That sounds ridiculous. I even think you should roll this up and carry it under your arm. Have you tried that? You Louis? try first. <laughs> All right, so this is the last of the stuff to carry. Dos piedra cantera. And a couple more things. Is that yeah, dude, have you actually done this like this? This hurts badly. Such a wimp. No, man, it's my head It's getting squished. <laughs> Mi cabeza es importante. I am ready to hike. Let's go. Follow me, boys. This is way mejor. Super mejor. Good news! We found the jungle soap. Jungle soap. Apparently, you take a shower with this, like this, yeah, and you just rub, rub it down. in. Full rub down. And it's good for your. Oh, oh. What is that called? Ooh, rico. It's kind of. I smell your hand, dude. <laughs> it's your hand not smells so good terrible. at all. Is that your hand or is that that? But apparently that's a jungle soap. Well, I'm definitely uh, it's bad. trying that that's tonight. Worse. <laughs> that's the worst. It's, it's, it's probably somebody fucking with us, and I bet it's like mosquito attractant. <laughs> in the water, okay. make it soapy. Yeah. Like this in water, fluff it up, fluff it up, yeah. and then pour the bucket over. Fresh. Fresh as can be. <laughs> so that, well, we don't use buckets here. We're more civilized than that. We have a hose. We're sophisticated. We yeah. don't live like animals. Not like yeah. animals no at all. more. No more. No. We, we have with, real beds. We we cook with propane. Real shower. Real beds is a stretch, mm -hmm. but it is. I'm sleeping Take here me. tonight in a me. real bed. Do you have your bed yeah, done? Check it out. Let's look at Louis's bed. Qua quadra? Quattro? No. Quadra. Mi quadra. Quadra de cama. Oh. Mi amigo Louis. Look at that, with toilet paper. Oh, <laughs> take a look at this. It'll go right ahead. Okay, I got a layer of comfort on top oh. of the planks. Fresh, not fresh, cardboard. Oh, <laughs> it got gorgeous. soaked a couple times, but now it's dry. Yeah. Put the screen, mosquito screen on top of that, above the tarp. Sleep like a baby. That is good, man. Mm -hmm. You've come a long way. Mm. Right? You wanna, hey, give it a little, let's do a tour. <laughs> Can we walk over the bed or around it? Don't step on the bed. Don't step on the bed? Who does no. that? So what do we have here? This is my my pet peeve. It's a flat surface is what we have here. <laughs> Valuable flat surfaces are on volcanoes. When you're done with your bed during the day, you put your bed on the other flat surface. That's right. For no reason at all. No reason at all. <laughs> I feel there could be better use for this flat surface. What is this? It's a little John Carlos shirt. Definitely. <laughs> That's his brand. We have the kitchen. My, whoa, whoa, let's go through a little John Carlos action here. Uh, my favorite, favorite use of 100 Cordobas. What's that? Carrying heavy material on heavy your shoulders material today? On shoulders. Put that gear on. Yeah, and it only mm. fits little John Carlos. I could never get into something like that. I bet you can. Well, I'm not going to try. It's not for me. Oh, more stuff. That's the sound of six being dropped at once where I only carried two. What do we have here? The new kitchen, new location. What a good spot. 
It is. This is what comfort looks like. It is. It's um, culinary arts station. Does it need culinary more arts explanation? I, I mean, <laughs> look at that. You got it all there. Yeah. Is it an ant tree? It's not an ant tree. Not just a branch, a real screw a holding screw. those. Eco terrorist. But this is my favorite one here. Is uh, the cup, cup tree. Cup tree. Yeah. Oh, there's real screws yeah, in there. It was so fancy. They got a hold of your drill. <laughs> yeah. And we have a, a fire station over there. We got to clean it up so it doesn't burn the whole jungle. But yeah, that's a new fire pit for nice. cooking. Big Everything's holes. brought back here. I'm really soapy. You are. You got that. You might. Dude, yeah. dude I smell so good right now. I don't want to ruin my brand. Would you love. Would you wash my hands? Let's see. Yeah. With volcano water? Mm -hmm. oh. Whoa, whoa. You're getting it in my cup. Thank you. Your beard juice. Mm. It seems that. Angel has a far superior bedroom. He's got the venue. skills. He's got the skills. Years of experience. Years. He, he lived a hard experience on the jungle. Jungle experience? A real days. cowboy. Real cowboy. He's got even a real cowboy hat, that one. That one? Yeah. I think it's yours. Yeah, but it's a real cowboy hat. It is, and he does he, have it. He, he deserves it. Yeah. He completed survivor. Day. Survivor. This yeah. is the only reason we're surviving here. I know. Are you making cafe? Oh, see that? Cafe on the volcano. Mejor. Mm -mm. Yeah. Instant. Quick, I, I gotta show you what I'm seeing. Whoa, watch your step there. <laughs> so this, Louis' bed, he talked about it, right? And he's like, yeah, it's great. I got my toilet paper, some of John Carlos' stuff. Usually, if you're looking for power or a USB, you'll find that phone. But this time, it's powerless. It's powerless. <laughs> John Carlos. Telefono has no USB. <laughs> so in here, now you can see clearly. Oh, just stick that little camera in there and take a look. This is Angel's version of a living quarter. And look at his towel hanging up here. Civilized, Angel. <whistles> Civilized. Pillow. Pillows? He's got a pillow? Fucking pillow. What do you got over there? I guess you had that brown pillow thing. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Something to aspire to. Yes. Yeah. I'm, I'm still, you know, it's, there was nothing here but jungle. We've deforested it. Yeah? Let's get to work. Get to work. Get to work. Absolutely excellent, I'd have to say. The stage is set. There'll be no audience at this performance, but as you can see, working together in perfect harmony almost like a symphony of welding construction look at John. there he is that's angel doing his thing he's dancing he's feeling it what they're doing is they're welding the feet together the feet go down we're going to use six feet on this three meter by six meter structure that we're going to build so they each have a little station with a easy flex welder and they basically weld that together and that's a one inch ready rod galvanized steel uh, with some crazy thick platina and then we'll put a little um, angle iron on there two inches on each side and the strap will just fiddle in there along the sides on all four sides the straps what will hold it all hold it all together well not hold it together but but keep it in place centered on the pieta cantera yeah, so now they're just cleaning them up after they finish welding. And uh, then they'll put this special paint on, an anti-corrosive uh, paint that's just used for the welds. We don't paint the material. There's a bug. It's pretty nice. <laughs> Working in the jungle. One weird bug comes at you. Every time you turn on the grinder, it comes flying at you. I'm sure you'll see it in one of our videos later. But just tons of them, they go kamikaze on you for the sound. That's, uh, what is that? Little, there's John Carlos welding again. So you, they basically have two welds that they've mastered now. <laughs> and uh, yeah, they do a pretty darn good job. It's super strong. That's what matters at the end of it all. Um, and the design looks pretty, pretty darn cool. 
So this is three by three, uh, heavy chapa, galvanized steel. And that's what we're gonna use to build the foundation frame. We actually build two floor panels and put them on the foundation and we'll be building a single foundation unit which is gonna be three meters by six meters. It's something we've never done before but we've always, always wanted to do it. There's our AccuCutter. That's how we cut them so perfectly every single time. We use that band saw there. We gave ourselves some shade so it's comfortable to work in. Holds all the metal we carried up the volcano, one by one by one. And there is Maurin. She is just making videos all day, every day, so you guys can uh, see what we're up to. So she's doing, I think, a thumbnail there for a YouTube show or video. The day ended fantastically last night. Um, Louie got back up to the camp and he's now sleeping outdoors. I've come back to Rebus to water Louie's plants in Buenos Aires and to get a tent so that I can join the fiesta up there in the um, job site. So we'll be up there for another probably two weeks to finish this job up. And then we have a little gap before we start off in our Pacific coast. Uh, building down in Madeiras and those beach areas. So we're gonna be in Ometepe for a little bit longer, about two weeks, maybe two, three weeks, we have a window and we'd love to build another rad pad while we're here in Ometepe. We have the jig there, everything, so come and visit us and uh, we can show you how it's done in person if you're interested in having a rad pad built um, on some of your property in Ometepe because I'm sure your property cannot be as challenging as this property. And if it is, I'd love to see it and check it out. Uh, everybody have a great night and thanks for watching Rad Pad.